All right, here's the question. I have an old Google account that still shows up on my device, and I want it removed from my device. Now, I can't show you Android, but I can show you iPhone. All right, I'm going to show you the two areas in an iPhone where you can remove or add Google accounts. Let's start in the Google Apps. Here's my Google Apps. I'll go into, into Drive. So I'm in Drive. Notice in the upper right-hand corner, I've got my picture of one of my accounts. I click on that picture. And then look there, Manage Accounts on this device. Click right there. And I have the ability to remove any one of the three accounts that I have on this device today. And furthermore, I can add another account. And when I'm done, I click Done. By the way, the same process works in Gmail. I go to Gmail, and in Gmail, I have this. Right now, this is looking at that B account, which is the uh, BCI Google testing. There it is. Manage accounts on this device. Click on that, and there's the same screen to get rid of any one of the Google accounts or add another from Gmail. And do that. I can do that from Gmail, Drive. I think I can do it from Calendar. Can I do it from Calendar? Yep. Upper right hand corner is the, my picture. Click on that, manage accounts, and it brings me to the same place. This is how to remove a Google account from the G, Google Apps on an iPhone. All right, let's look at the next area. Under Apple settings, click on Apple stuff. In my case, yours might be somewhere else. Click on settings. In settings, I recommend you go, to, it's the easiest way for me and I found to do it. I recommend you go down to mail. You can do some contacts as well, but go to mail. And then you'll see there's accounts. I click on accounts. There's three different accounts in my iPhone connected to the iPhone apps. I have iCloud, I have TL Burris, TLB Business, and I have Score. And you'll notice that on both of uh, TLB business, I have mail, contacts, and calendar, and on score, I have mail, contacts, and calendars. I can click on any one of them, and there's the delete icon, or I can simply remove one of the services if I wanted to, but that delete account is how I would remove one of the Google accounts that is connected to the iPhone apps. Those are the two areas on an iPhone where you can remove or add a Google account.